How's it going, everyone? This is Dr. Hefe playing more Crusader Kings 3, the Pandya Dynasty 7 Holy Cities Achievement Run. And in the last episode, we lost Samrat Varakunavarman II, our grandfather. He died of old age. And look at him. He was quite amazing. He was in 18 wars, so did better than his father, did better than his grandfather. I think he may have the most. He was the most warmongering of all the Varakunavarmans. And he was able to get us the two more holy cities, the holy city of Ujjaini as well as Mathura. And we are very, very close to Haridwar. Vranasi and Ayodhya. So it's up to his grandson, Samrat Varakunavarman the third. He's quite young, 23 years old, although he is a drunkard, so he gets a tiny health penalty. He's a devotee of Ganga. So we're going to do the usual thing when we have a transition of power. Our military might has gone way, way down, which is kind of unfortunate. Let's see, what is he? He has the diplomacy lifestyle. August could be pretty good. We could actually want to get an ally. That may be nice. Um, do we want prestige? We don't really need to do a subjugation war, actually. We're very close that we can just fabricate claims on different things. So yeah, maybe just more diplomacy, having people like us more. Although I kind of do want to make up for our horrible martial skills. But we don't really need any of these perks in the martial title tree. Uh, flexible truces. This could actually be useful. So yeah, we'll grab this one. Um, haven't really thought about what the best perks are, but we are very, very close to just getting whatever we need. Now we have a betrothal to uh, this lady. Um, she's allied to us. I don't even know who she is. Where does she come from? She's a child of these parents. I don't think she's even getting us an alliance. So we're going to break this betrothal. We are going to find ourselves a spouse worthy of our, uh, our amazing kingdom. And we don't need inheritable traits. That's fine. We just need somebody with really high martial score, basically. So let's see. Some of all skills. Wow. Our courtier. Very, very cool. Wait, is this... Is this... <laughs> this was our, uh, our grandfather's wife. No wonder she's so amazing. Of course he would have chosen the most amazing uh, person to be his wife. Do we, do we do that? Do we marry our grandfather's wife? That would be kind of weird. Kind of weird. Um, let's see, this would get us an alliance. Let's see, what, what does relevance tell us? That we should marry Paduma Pandya. Okay, she's got okay skills, okay skills. No, no, no. Let's go back to some of all skills. And I wish that you could do like a double sort here. Probably harped on and on about this because I would like to really take care of our liege's horrible martial skill. Um, let's see. This person seems pretty cool. She's got 12 martial, really high stewardship, pretty low intrigue, but some okay learning as well. So let's get this marriage going. We're going to lose uh, some prestige. That's fine. Long live the Samrat. Exactly. Let's get our marriage on. Now factions are going to start to get together and try to beat us up. No, we don't need money. We need prestige. Need lots and lots of prestige. Let's host a feast. Let's try and have everybody like us as much as possible. Oh, we need some chancellors for sure. This dude, he seems like a great chancellor. Hey, aren't you the... You're the cannibal, right? My grandfather told me about you. Uh, yeah, let's assign this person. This guy seems like he's a really good marshal and spy master. Yeah, we'll put this dude in. Sure. And then we need probably a better... Wow, we don't really have any good... Oh, look at him. Damn, he's buff. I wonder what his prowess is. 19 prowess? Oh, he's an amazing knight. Hopefully we can find a, a better priest for our our empire. And what do we need our priest to do, actually? We want to fabricate a claim up here. Get into Haridwar. 
Uh, we have too many holdings, so we need to get rid of one of those because that's going to cause people to be upset at us. Um, some people are upset. Somebody, people are dead. I'm stumbling outside to relieve myself. I'm just trying to take a piss. And then Dhammapati Marcos is stabbing Dhammapati Tripavana Kakaravatakal. My goodness. My silence has a price? No, we're rich. We are rich. What have you done? Wait, no. We're going to expose him. Everyone will know of your crime. You just murdered somebody. Who even are you? The Dama of Dindigul. Alright, at least that isn't in my capital province. My goodness, sir. I need to go to some anger management classes. Upgrade some holdings. Uh, how, how dangerous is this faction? No, we don't actually have any real dangerous factions. I don't think. A feast in my house? Man, this is like the worst feast ever. Did everything I could ensuring Dama Patni Kariyamateva and Samrajni Padmalava De <clears throat> Devi would be as far from each other as possible and they're coming to blows. Somebody got murdered. Now there's a fight going on. Oh, apparently we can do the royal halt because of my high diplomacy. The royal halt. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, we have too many lands. Uh, my brother, he could use more lands. Here you go. Knock yourself out. My feasts are departing. Uh, maybe I can ask my wife to uh, adopt my faith. She will do it. Excellent. We gained, I think, enough prestige from that giant party to uh, become distinguished. So now even more people will start to like me. Let's go back to factions. Yeah, yeah we don't have anybody who's going to try to overthrow us. That's great. We could do a, a small war over here. I think we do have a claim on Asir Gar, which is part of the Buran Parid Duchy. So yeah, let's uh you know let's flex our might. Why not? Those war elephants need to get some exercise every now and then. Let's see what's happening here. Working late again, my lord. My wife peeks over my shoulder, glancing at some of the documents. I have some experience with these matters. That's why we married you. You're super smart, even though you are lowborn. How do you know about all these uh, different things? Nothing would please me more. I think I can handle it. Or it's not worth the effort. No, no, let's have our wife help us out. A good husband listens to his wife. So we'll roll in here. Split this army in half. Take this second army to go beat these dudes up. What do we have? Oh, apparently we got... Oh, that's right, because of uh, that new man-at-arms thing. We have a bunch of people here. Need to increase these up. Get that larger. I don't think we need more light footmen. We'll just uh, get rid of that. That way we can have space for more heavy infantry. We got the the Kandayats. All right, excellent. I need to pay those guys more money. What happens to all of our money here? Raised armies, expensive. How's my guy's stewardship? 10. Oh my goodness. Levy size minus 10%. We could really use some help in uh, all things military. Well, let's just go sit on his uh, capital. We have a new diplomacy perk. Yeah, flexible truces could be good. Independent ruler can propose one alliance without a marriage. Yeah, let's uh, let's grab ourselves a strong ally just in case we go to war. Who would be a good ally? I think Bana. They're they're pretty cool. These guys, we. I mean, we didn't beat them up. It's, uh, it was our, our grandfather. It's not our fault. Uh, we don't need... Yeah, we will need to go to war with them for Ayodhya. So actually, we don't want to ally these guys or these guys. Yeah, Bana could be fine. 
We were allies in the past. Uh, we could also get these allies over here in uh, Pagan and Kandras without having to send any of our any of our daughters off to those horrible places where they die in childbirth every time. This guy's running in here to fight us. I guess they're pretty desperate. Is this the one with the... No, it doesn't have the elephants, so they were lucky that time. But yeah, these sieges are going to be done very soon, and we'll take this land perfectly for months. Somebody's been digging up some claims on the Thakana of Munda. Munda? Isn't Munda down here? Where is Munda? Over here. Does he have no shame? Oh, it's not something we directly control. It's something uh, one of our vassals controls, but I don't think we really care too much. This guy, you know what? This is kind of like within your duchy. Here you go, and you're some long-lost cousin of ours. I have this title. I'm call a hunt. It's probably a good idea. I mean, more prestige never really hurts. So let's sound the horn. People will like us a little bit more. Let's see, somebody's acting rude. Look at that false witch, Rudramba. My vassal, Rani Rudramba. Why is he calling her a witch? She's not even, is she a real witch? Surprised we haven't gotten witchcraft yet in this playthrough. Uh, you'll get tasted the belt. Oh, this is no way for him to act. We gain mediator. Our guy is really good at talking when he's not drinking. We're going to have a lot of people like us. Bow in hand. My subversive vassal, fully concentrated. What a shame. Oh, we would shoot him down and kill him? No, this is not the way. This is not the way we do it. I mean, would we actually shoot someone? We have very low martial. We do have some... Prowess, I suppose. Let's see. Yeah, we got the boar. Excellent, excellent. We're doing good. Somehow one of our counselors died of old age. Very sad. We have a new counselor, though, who also has amazing martial skill. Uh, but I think we're just preparing for our war up here to get Herodwar. Child of my dynasty. This is my cousin. Ah, oh, the pretty one who married the intelligent one. Oh, how sweet. We can negotiate an alliance with... Ah, oh, my brother! My brother who controls Dwarka. He, look how happy he is. He's so happy. I'm just here like, oh man, being emperor is so difficult. I have to drink this beer all day and all night. It's tough. It is tough. Excellent. We get our claim. Ooh. We can ask for all of their lands. The whole Tomara Raj. I mean, but they only have... Oh, well, I guess they have two lands that are part of the Tomara Raj. Yes, give me all of it. We are greedy. And while you're at it, go fabricate the claim on Ranasi. Why do we... Non-adjacent? Why? Because of the major river crossing? Please. Please. Look at that. That's adjacent enough to me. Uh, the Ganges. The Ganges River. Alright, we'll declare our war for our claims. We want it all. Although, let's see. What does this do? I get the Tamara Raj. She becomes our vassal. I don't really want her to become our vassal. Oh, I should have just done it for the land itself. Because then we'll have to, like... Sway her, make her like us. Oh well. Can't have it all in one second. Um, we'll raise them all here. Oh, I was supposed to... Whoops. Raise them all here. I forgot to control click. I messed up. I was supposed to negotiate my alliance with that other dude. I kind of forgot to. She's negotiating an alliance with somebody. 
I don't think any of your allies are going to save you from this marauding force. We have some people dying in our dungeons. Let's see. Some of these lowborns were probably... Can, uh, can be killed. They don't really even have have some friend. This guy's their friend, but whatever. He doesn't even have any relationships. We'll gain a little bit of dread. Let people know that we aren't messing around over here. Capturing people's guests. That would suck. You're just chilling out, being a guest in a castle, which actually sounds pretty alright. But then some invading force comes and throws you in their prison, possibly to be executed in order to make the peasants fear him. Another child of our dynasty. Look how handsome this baby is. Now this would be a cute baby. It already has hair with on day zero. It's pretty amazing. Alright, so they are under our control. Apparently everybody here. What is she all upset about? Declare war, fabricated claim, liege holes, de jure duchy. Oh, I need to give the de jure duchy to this kid. Probably. There you go. We have too many duchies. Yeah, Raj of Kuru. Yeah, there you go. Here you go. Um, could you please force this lady to uh, convert? She will not. Let's see how alive is she? She's poor. She could live long enough to be swayed to uh, our religion, because we now have the fifth holy site, Heredwar. Uh, we just need to convince her. Of the glories of Vaishnavism. There's a snake in our court. Not a snake in our boot. Open up, sweetheart. It's I, Pertle. Is Maharani Pertle. Yeah, what about her? You have no shame? Oh, dude, this dude's committing some adultery in the capital. Yeah, come on, man. Commit adultery somewhere else, please. Um, we do have better people who would be good at chancellorship, but I don't think it really matters. Yeah, he's fine. But yeah, now we can uh we can do our. Oh, we wanted to pros the alliance over here. That's right. Oh, now he's at war. When will there be peace in our time? All we want is peace. No more war. Prisoners that can be ransomed. Please. Leave these lands. Go on. Do something better with your lives. Let's see, do we have a barracks built anywhere? I don't think I have one in my main keep. So let's build one over here. For more heavy infantry damage. My wife is pregnant! What a wonderful day! What a wonderful day. And we're, like, we're, we're kind to our wife. We're having a good time. Things are going nicely there. We're having a feast. Oh yeah. Excellent. We're a drunkard. We're gonna enjoy this feast, that's for sure. An exposed affair. Oh my goodness. Let's see. What, let's see. I'm trying to think what our character would be. They're humble. They're gregarious, though. They're down to have a good time. And generous? I think they'd be chill with adultery. Let's see. There's a dilemma going on. You can talk to this guy. Lose some more stress. Yeah, we're gregarious. We want to have conversations with people. We want to have a good time. Farewell, my vassal. Again, just having good times all around. We're waiting to uh, get our claim on this land. It's going to take nine more months. That's fine. Could press our uh, claim over here. Go uh, go beat this guy up. 
seize his lands. It is rightfully ours. Again, let the war elephants stretch their legs. Just roll on in. are being constructed over here. Uh, yeah, let's construct some more barracks. Why not? Even though we don't have any spearmen, we do have some heavy infantry now. Let's upgrade their size. Now that we're just hanging around. Trappings of Majesty. Do we want some resplendent raiment? No, we're too humble and too generous. We'll have the local fashions or we do not need things yeah we do not need things we are very humble we shall gain just piety even though piety does nothing for us we have a son rajkumar sivakoluntan oh my son may you grow to be strong and wise however you probably won't uh see much of the world. Yeah, we'll ransom this guy off. We want his money. Because it will be up to Samrat Varakuna Varman III to take the remaining holy cities for himself. Ranasi, very, very close. <gasps> the mighty elephant? Ooh, a truly impressive gift from an overseer in the Thakana of Nav Navasaraka and beckons me to come with him. I'm greeted by a gargantuan elephant, larger than any I've ever seen. The beast will certainly bring devastation. I believe that should be an A to any foe. I will ride this mighty beast into battle personally. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Marshall, the creature is yours. My knight could make good use of it. Oh my goodness, he could make good use of it. Let us honor Hayagriva and release it? No, no, no. I mean, we're not riding into battle. But yeah. Dude. 30 prowess. This man is a beast. Nobody could nobody could even deal with that man. They couldn't. They wouldn't be able to. Okay, flexible truces. Sir, is your war done? We would like to... Oh. He's losing his war. Because his war is all the way up there. How did you even get an alliance all the way up there? Let's see. Captured some people. Please. Get out of my dungeons. Something, something. Somebody's trying to get some claims on us. Uh, looks like... This dude's about to lose his lands? What's what's going on here? Defending the war claim on Raj of Kuru. Oh, someone wants to take this land. Oh, he took this land directly for himself. Oh man, I wish I could offer to join your war. It looks like you are losing, my good sir. This man will soon take it from you. So we'll sway him. Just in case he takes it. My dear cousin, we now have some new lands. Some new lands for us to take. This man thinks that his alliance will save him. Wow, that is a pretty strong military alliance, though. Let's see. Maybe we do grab an alliance with this dude. Of course he's going to accept. This man has been our... Our... I was going to say... <laughs> our poor dog of war like we forced him to go into all these battles for us but no he is a trusted ally i think we had one war against uh the kingdom of orissa but no longer now we find peace a new age of peace also our military has really popped up very very highly we have some people who are discontent oh well such is life our poor cousin, though, is going to lose this land. He's definitely going to lose this land. Maybe I can give him some money. He can hire some uh, mercenaries to take care of it. There you go. Cousin, take care of it. Uh, but yes, now we have a claim over here on Vranasi. Definitely want to get 
close up into Ayodhya. Oh man, we are so close. So very, 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 very close. To, to declare war. Oh, let's see. Does anyone have a claim on Ayodhya? No, they do not. But yeah, that will do it for this episode. Next episode, we will grab the sixth holy city. And who knows? Maybe even the seventh? No, nah, that would be... That would be really amazing, but I don't think we'll be able to fabricate our claim over here. Let's see, how long would it take? Only two years. Actually, maybe maybe we just start our fabrication over there. And who knows? Maybe the next episode will be the last episode when we take all the holy cities for ourselves. We shall see next time. Until then, do remember, as always, to take care of yourself.